Hey everybody, Jeff Stone here. And rather than doing a trailer for the uh, my lecture notes, the this is going to just kind of walk you through what you're getting. Uh, your copy won't have this stripe across it. That's just the proof I got back from the printer. But um, what's in here? There's six effects, full effects, full routines, and they're detailed out quite a bit in here. And this is all in full color. Uh, some of the photos are black and white, but these are, let me see. I tell you full color, and then there's no color pictures. Uh, somewhere there we go it's color photographs and let me find a better shot there you go there's some stuff right here okay so there's a few black and white photos but most of it's it's full color and um, there uh, there you go more color right there so what you'll find here again six effects and these are effects that uh, are in my lecture and that some of these effects I've been doing for like 30 years for example the target card literally been doing that trick for 30 years and it's one of my favorite card tricks to do. And there's, there's, it can be done with a borrowed shuffle deck, no problem. But there's a couple little extra things I like to add to it that requires no, no extra special cards or anything, but just a little bit extra you have to carry with you if you're going to be doing it in your show. Might as well have that stuff ready. So, but six full effects in here. And then there's a what I call the rapid fire section. For example, there's a couple ideas in there on how to get rid of these vinyl wallets right to stop carrying these around and to use something else that uh, makes it a little bit more not like these are special cards you got at a magic shop right so there's a couple ideas like that there's a thing in there i call the million dollar idea which will literally save you hundreds of dollars when you make your gimmicks up particularly with um, money gimmicks right uh, so lots of little things like that, but in the lecture, that section only takes about 10 minutes. It's just, here's the idea, let's talk about it. If you have any questions, let me show you how it works. If you are a fan of that old penetrating matchstick routine, um, there's a really cool idea in there that e even for those who have dry hands who can't do it, like myself, I used to be able to do it no problem, but my hands got dry as I got older. I found a way around it, it's really cool. There's something for the linking rubber bands, a really cool unlink that looks really magical. Um, there's a thing for the uh, haunted key that makes the haunted key look a lot more creepy. A lot you have a lot more control over how the key moves and just adds a little extra creep factor to it. It's really cool. So lots of little ideas like that. The six effects I can just quickly run through them. Uh, one of them is the target card, as I mentioned, and one of them is Dream Vacation. And now, if you listen yet. carefully, here's how I got the coin across the board. Listen to this can. Coin kind of just materialized enough. You let go of my wrist there, take a peek inside. It really is yes. gone. Just take the lid off. No funny stuff here. Oh man! Hold that for me. Sure. Open your hand up. Can you see your initials in there? Let's get the camera on that yeah. too as well. You can see them. Oh yeah. That's your initials. Take Sweat a peek. off half of it. <laughs> this. <laughs> um, and then there is quarter bird, which is uh, an, a variation or an update on. The old, um, you know, you got a coin in your hand and the, the pen's going to tap it on the back of your hand and then the uh, coin's going to vanish. I think most of you know what I'm talking about. But I've added a little extra kicker to that that is uh, interesting and, and is done with the signed coin. There's that. There's a really cool presentational idea for the old, the little uh, color vision cubes, right? And uh, it'll make you actually want to break out your color vision cube and use it. There's a trick in there with tarot cards that's based on Bob Neal's effect, Soul Survivor. And there's one, uh, oh, uh, Bad Medicine. I don't know if I've listed them all, but Bad Medicine is uh, pretty much an anything to a sealed bottle of medicine, right? Those little tubes of medicine that you can get at the gas station. You hear that coming off there? That is completely sealed. By the way, the spectator could open this up if they'd like, and there should be a nice, lovely green Skittle in there with the rest of the medicine. You can get anything in there, money, cards, candy, whatever you want, and there's a whole bunch of ideas on how to use that and, and how do you get the stuff in and out of it and so forth. So really cool stuff there. So a whole bunch of um, rapid-fire ideas. There's eight of those, and then there's six effects. And again, it's full color, and it is about... 65 pages there's also qr codes sprinkled throughout in here and the qr codes uh will take you to uh different di different things maybe a little clip of a video demonstration there's a free tool in here you can download that helps you create uh, fake receipts so that looks like you bought it from walmart 
do not use it to cheat and <laughs> and and make a Walmart receipt. Um, if you tried it, it wouldn't quite be legitimate anyway. But it's it's the, it's made. It's a tool that you can download. There's a QR code in there. You can download it, and it lets you create receipts. Uh, I use it for my Effect Visa 2.0, but I also use it for maybe for book tests where I print out a receipt from Barnes and Noble to show that I just bought this book, you know, on the way to my gig. I've done th that kind of thing. I use it for that kind of thing. So lots of different things you can do with it, uh, but it lets you print out fake receipts. You can use it for mentalist predictions, and there's a whole bunch of ideas on what you can do with it in the book here. So that's it. Thanks for your interest in the Stone Cold Lecture Notes.